guys and welcome back to another video with me and Val Central where today you join me back on Ammonford, back on Roblox where today we are going to be driving this vehicle, the Optane Metro Rider I've never driven this vehicle on this game before, it's only just recently been introduced so I thought why not, Let, why not have a little drive of it I've been lucky enough to be, to travel on an Optane Metro Rider in my time um, if you haven't already do check out Ammo Bus videos um, I travelled on one at the Total Models event, uh, the Blackpool Tramway, um, last year. So do go and check that out, it's quite a popular video because it's quite a rare bus to actually get a ride on. Um, but I travelled on one over there, so if you are wanting to see the cross reference of the virtual um, model to the real life model, do go and check that out. So today we're going to be driving Route 14 to Dan Wylan, a route I used to drive a lot back on the original, original, original map um, that is uh, that is going back quite a number of years. Let, we'll have to ignore that flickering texture. Um, yeah, should be quite a nice drive. So we'll go and have a wander. Go and have a wander around the stand. So I have just been listening to these sounds as I've driven up here from the depot, um, and it is—it's quite a. Quite realistic, I'd say. Worrying, worryingly enough, I never thought I'd say that phrase when it came to Roblox, but it is pretty much rather realistic when it comes to the sounds. So, there we go, down Wildland Asda. It's going to lag a tad when we get up to the Asda. I'm just going to pre warn you about that. But I was going to drive the city circle, but then I thought, hang on, that route's going to be way too short. So I thought I'd drive something with a bit of length to it, otherwise it's going to be quite a quite a quick video to say the least. We do actually need some length to these videos. So I'm not sure that they have a brand new Optair stable wheel on them, on the Metro Riders. There we go, I always pop the horn before I reverse. There's a lowlander, a cadet park there. So I'm led to believe I did do some, um, when I mentioned about the potential work that I might be doing to humble buses, somebody did mention that um, they wanted the map catered for the Spectra and the Upturn Metro Rider. So I'm unsure, um, how true that is, as I have not seen any screenshots yet, so from what I've gathered, there's a Metro Rider coming, so that should be quite interesting. So, definitely be able to have quite a nice comparison of the bus. Now, I've got to keep doing this every time I need to check where I'm going because that visor um, on this vehicle is making it quite difficult. It's also quite a loud bus, is this one. there's the realistic sounds of people on the bus as well. Um, I can imagine whoever recorded this had quite an interesting time trying to record the sounds as we run a full bus. Whoa, 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 whoa. And we say that our videos are not interesting. Um, well then. I certainly wasn't expecting to be doing that today. But what have we learned now? We've learned that this vehicle does not like being sped up on hills. Shall we continue and pretend that that didn't happen? I think we should. So I know back in, back in sort of the day when I used to do the original recordings, at that point I'd have stopped recording and reset it and tried to go for the perfect video. But there's no point in showing you guys the perfect videos, sometimes that can be relatively boring. So we're going near the castle, I'm hoping to drive the 19 route at some point, I might do that in the next video actually. Um, as that is a really nice bus route to drive, although it can suffer heavily from sort of levels of lag because it's quite a... 
quite an interesting um, route to drive because of how detailed by um, robot standards the castle is very very detailed on that level so it does lag quite a, quite a lot. This is can be a lag exception as well. We've got the nice view of the castle in the background. Or well, not the background, in the right ground. The right ground. I'm not central making up new words. Apologies, I do keep having to zoom it out to check which way I'm turning. It's, it's been quite a while since I've driven this room. So I, don't, I just don't want to make a wrong turn. And I mean, I've already had a massive, massive crash. Uh, but, you know, it's still nice to have a level of realism. But let's just check this before we put them. As I have not been sideswiped by a bus. the lag three, we're doing quite well. Oh, well that didn't stop us long. Oh, it never does at this bus stop. So there we go. Right. Quite a poor repark that. There we go. Quite a poor parking at Alton to be fair. Um, and there's that say saving your complaints every day. Oh I love this map. Oh apologies. I just clicked out of it and then comes back on. Have I changed the line? Yes, maybe I've changed it. I have answered, I just looked at the line. Realised it changed and then had to chop it in. This is the worst section I'd say of the entire game for lag because I stopped being able to control the bus. This is usually the section of the route I actually called the game for me. <laughs> like it, like an onset to the quiet this yeah, like an onset. Pause the game for a minute and then wait for it to reload. But I think that's it, I think we got out of that relative to like three. It's quite good. Always lags for every player on that corner. Every player is that spot. Quite a nice vehicle to drive, definitely the worth of the way. Something different, what you wanted this game, something a bit different. Because we all know I used to drive my Olympics around um, on Grimsby, so I do miss them. But it's quite nice to drive something a bit different from time to time. Although I was watching a few of those streams back that I used to do. Um, although, as, as you remember, Choose the Life is back at the moment. I don't know what episode we're on, as I don't know when this video is going to be released. But it will be on next Tuesday um, on Choose the Life. So do keep watching that as we do keep throwing back to interesting times and interesting mods, etc. So do make sure you keep watching that. Um, but I was watching one of the original Choose the Life streams um, going back into Grimsby. And it's quite interesting to compare how far these vehicles and robots have come. Like I know a few of you will be sat there thinking it's quite depressing that the steering wheel doesn't move. Um, but having driven on a few different operators and a few different games where the steering wheel does move, I'd be quite thankful it doesn't because when the game does one of its lag spikes, the wheel basically loses it. There we go, past the castle. Oh, 
Oh. Oh, you know what? We'll just we'll nip, nip through Compass Depot. Because I was busy, I was busy looking at the sign, thinking I was a 10. There we go. Be thankful for the Compass Depot for its great uses. So what did we learn last time? We learned don't speed up on this hill. Otherwise the bus decides to come out and lose it. There we go. Flawless. That's good, more or less. So I'm going to be the no lander, so I pan. Only in jealousy, only in jealousy. I mean, I'd have preferred if they'd have changed the green as I was pulling up rather than when I'd stopped, but you know, still love it all. Do the usual drop off, the usual check to make sure everybody's off the bus. All the invisible people get off. Ah, hold on. Invisible people are good at listening. Very good listeners. Ah, Cadet is still here. Might be a different one. I'm hoping it's a different one. If not, it's still here. There we go. So that was the 14 service. We did a full round trip. So that was quite a nice run. I enjoyed it. I don't know about you. So thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. If you have questions, suggestions, you need to download those data, ask me in the comments. The bus station appears to have disappeared in our field view. So, um, which is, yeah, it has disappeared in our field view. That's quite interesting. Um, even though the building behind it has loaded in. Hmm. So. Thanks again for watching, and I do hope to see you in the next video I make. Goodbye for now. Bye.